Alright guys, um, I'm back today with another tutorial and this is the uh, typography tutorial that y'all had requested in the comments in my other video. I'm going to display uh, an example on screen for a second. <laughs> my text right here and I just have it you know placed wherever I want it you know just using position and such just to place it wherever you want it and um, make sure enable 3d is on because that's going to be important so what you want to do is put a uh, camera layer on here and a no and you want to use a little lip thing put it up there Make that 3D, and now everything moves. You have control of all of this. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to zoom in on the word uh, typography up here. Oh, all right. Before I get to moving my camera, I I can actually uh, animate the word typography using this I my, my I myself haven't actually played with all of the options here but the one I use is the scale one and this basically makes your text go like this and um, so what I do I set it to about 18 and uh, oh my god this comp is way too long huh? Uh, so depending on how long I want it for this, I'll just tab it on 28 frames. Put it up to about 94. And I'm easy ease this. Here's my graph. Actually looks bad. Hold on. Let me adjust it. That looks a little bit better. I'm actually going to turn on motion blur just to um, yeah, make it look a little better. I normally use RSMB, but for this, I'm just going to use regular motion blur. All right, we got that got that part animated. So um, what we can do is start moving things around with the camera. I'm just going to set a position keyframe right here. All right. And over here, where this little rectangle is, this is where uh, one of our other words is. I think it's the word uh, today. And we can just go ahead and move this over there. Oh, I'll set a keyframe. I know it's not going in order that would make sense. Typography today tutorial, but. And we'll just go with it. Uh, so. You see right here, it kind of looks really bad. So we're gonna fix that. Easy ease. And um, here's the graph right here. Make these come in some. I actually wanna put this out a little bit more. Alright, so it kind of goes fast at the beginning and slows down at the end. And I'm going to move it down to the uh, last word. Put that there. And graph it. I'm touching the wrong graph. No, I'm touching. I'm touching this. All right. I'm gonna play this back. And the ending of that really, the ending of this really bothers me. But hey, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna touch this up a little bit. Right. All right. 
and um and it's just a really basic thing with the 3D camera it looks not all that great but just for the tutorial and it looks pretty okay and um we can actually just go ahead and um animate the other words the same way we did with uh, typography And um, if you want, if you don't want the layer, layer to be dog uh, all black, you can just add a background to it, any color. You can also add a little bit of shadow to it. Uh, the effect drop shadow, just go to per, uh, perspective and it's just right here. Let's just play it back. And that's really it. Well, I mean, just for basic stuff. I'm still learning this myself, so I apologize I didn't go in more depth with it. But, uh, yeah. That's just basic typography. Uh, thank you for, for watching. If you enjoyed, please drop a like, subscribe, and whatever. And I'll see y'all later.